What does he want for this? 23 grand. He got an extra zero on that? If I started with the right chassis and I spent $23,000, I could have exactly what I wanted. I'm not a fucking drifter. I want to take this car on the street. I want to beat motherfuckers on the street. I want to beat girls on the street. I want to fuck girls on the street. <laughs> Wait. I want to fuck guys on the street. God. June's going to be rough on collector cars. <laughs> I want it to look good. I want a car that looks good and I want it to have AC. It's not a ridiculous ask, but these people ask act like if you have a 240 it has to be a piece of shit. no <laughs> false pants on fire it doesn't 95 240sx 12 6 already sold ontario california runs and drives perfect car to link to learn into drifting does great drifting i have only taken it to one track event to learn in did amazing all day no issues at all throughout the whole day could use basic good maintenance for one has day. big mushroom too Fuck, and this thing sold god Makes damn big... it's got that cheese grater front <laughs> it's got a one, welded diff did one event he's ready to go sell it did so good it gotta go it, look how good it did the bumpers on the fucking ground everyone was so impressed <laughs> Jesus. Was it worth it, dude? <laughs> I mean, I guess he got... It sold. He probably got 12 out of it. What do you he think he got? He threw the new Chally lip on it, and he sold it. I don't know how, but he did it. <laughs> it's got um Gram lights on the front, and then 350Z wheels on the back. Yeah, yeah, that's what it looks like, but, like, you have to ask yourself, who... who's buying this, man? Who's the, <laughs> who's the dude putting down the money for this stuff? Idiots. We're out here... We're out here doing God's work trying to stop you from... For making dumb decisions. They're not in God's country out you can't in California. Tell everyone. Not here. No, yeah, yeah that's a is, godless land. This yeah. is target country, man. Right. <laughs> this we're we're in tuck country. Whoa, whoa, hold on. It's got a Mishimoto radiator though. Oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> and an NRG Prisma seat. He's got the nicest shit available. Dang. AO for show. Yep, this car is running. Is this even this car? It sounds like one of the ones where it's another car in the background running to make that car sound better. <laughs> is this an oil fitting on the turbo? Oh, oh is it one of those pump up ones like Damien ran? Oh, God. <laughs> the ones where you just like, it's got like a U valve on or whatever. You better remember to grease your turbo or it's just going to fail. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Grease it every 10,000 miles or, or every 10,000 RPM. I don't know. It's It looks. No, that but... that I think it's a vacuum line for the wastegate, but I I I don't know. Yeah, I, I really don't know either. I just I see an open hole on a anything 240SX related, and it's it's a little okay, suspect. Okay, Caliber says it's an EFR turbo, and that's a spot to put a speed sensor. Okay, good to know. Not a problem. It's then. got some empty holes. Otherwise, though, look at the turn signal and underneath it. Yeah, yeah. it's got yeah. plenty of yeah. empty holes on this thing. You buy this if you want somebody to stick your. Right. <laughs> Nick, your sticks is gonna crack dash, you know what I'm saying? I've seen him do it. <laughs> 95 Nissan 246 S14 Zinke Takoki Drift Project with an RB25. I have had this car for over three years working it, but might go a different route with a new drift car. 168K on the chassis. Has a super doof body kit with Origin Lab 75mm front doof. FR fenders. Rear quarter panels are not cut. New wrap peeling up in a few areas. Has some bullshit on the inside. Has some bullshit on the suspension. Has an RB25 <laughs> DET with a whole bunch of bullshit on that as well. Car does run and drive, but car does need a tune. They always do and it needs a bunch of stuff and then there's a whole list of cons um including it's a salvage title and some other bullshit jesus what does he want for this 23 grand why you got an extra zero on that my god I mean, it doesn't look bad in the pictures it's not finished it has a whole lot wrong with it 25 23 is and a it has a crazy salvage ass. title but if i if i started with the right chassis and i spent twenty three thousand dollars I could have exactly what I wanted yeah. and not yeah. a only for the street drift car that who cares? I'm not a fucking drifter. I want to take this car on the street. I want to beat motherfuckers on the street. I want to beat girls on the street. I want to <laughs> girls on the street. I want to guys on the street. Hell yeah, dude. You know? <laughs> oh, that's okay now. <laughs> okay, we're good. We're good. God. June's going to be rough on collector cars. <laughs> I want it to look good. I want a car that looks good and I want it to have AC. It's not it's not a ridiculous ask, but these people act like, like if you have a 240, it has to be a piece of shit. No, <laughs> false, <laughs> pants on fire. It doesn't. Do you just give me the politifact on that? Jeez. <laughs> yes, that was politifact. No, your 240 does not have to be a piece of shit. Fact checked. Yeah, false. let's check Snopes on this one. Fact checked by American patriots. I'm trying to talk some shit. Discord.gg/slash feed. Let's talk some shit. 
Twitch. Give me your money. 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 All new sticker designs Give and our classics are available at collectorcarfeed.com slash store. Give me your money. I've posted it before, but this is my old man car. You know how fast you can make a Silverado for $23,000? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Twenty-three grand will buy you two C5 vets that'll run circles around any of these. 240s. <laughs> a C4. Yeah. A C3 even. I don't know. God. You C can buy C3 you that one. An early C3. An early C3. 92 240 SX. 9500 bucks. St. Paul, Minnesota. 200K. Been thinking a lot lately of letting go of my project and the S chassis platform as a whole so all my other parts come with it. Why the f*** can't these people write sentences? <laughs> my they're, old man because car. because they're so ashamed of their, of their life choices, dude. Like, <laughs> motherfucker, I don't give a sh about oh been thinking a lot late like just say hey i'm selling this car yeah this is what it has this is what's good this is what's bad we don't need the story sell the car yeah i don't give a f about your life story i don't care about how this was a bad choice and and you hate it yeah just sell it i mean it still says a lot about the car though it tells us that the owner's a fucking idiot like we had the one <laughs> earlier where it's the all the ellipses and you could tell it's some fucking boomer that yeah thinks too much of the car this is the opposite of that it's they do this because they're ashamed like neckier said but it's it's because when you list something on facebook everybody that you know is going to see the listing is gonna yeah. see it yeah and, it, right. and it, it's the admission of guilt basically yeah, yeah, it's all like your car friends are gonna shit on you it's for like this. yeah all y'all were right i couldn't build this car yeah i don't really remember anything extra i've got for it but it's like six tubs of soon parts i've tried everything <laughs> to the best of my ability on this car correctly without doing any sketch on it i'm probably missing a lot of things on this post so feel free to message me with questions price wise i'm not set on a definitive price but somewhere around the nine thousand dollar area i'm open to reasonable offers and trades it's got an rb20 so in, in, in all that he told you absolutely nothing not a word oh, no all then he went down the is, list of uh... is year make model and this is what's done it's an rb20 with a, a bunch of bullshit and I guess it doesn't run right. Uh, it doesn't look like it's fully assembled either. Like this math is just that's, going to nothing. Yeah, yeah that's like no a filter. And it has a hood dump. Cringe. It's got the Invader Zim fuel rail here. <laughs> got, Jesus um, Christ. A bunch of ISR crap. I'm so glad I don't like these things because you guys. Are <laughs> it makes your life a lot easier. Right? Oh, shh. <laughs> Jesus, Damn. Jesus! They Damn. Look, they, yeah, no, they she's like done. That. No, you get a you get a cap that you can weld in right over that. It makes it brand new, dude. No, dude, <laughs> it's not. That's not how that works. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit! All right, just this is like ostrich wow. shit. Just because your head's in the sand, don't mean the fucking rust ain't there. Yeah, yeah, you're right, dude. It might be the worst rail I've ever seen. Honestly, really it's bad. It's no, bad. I've seen a lot of Dakota rails that look just like that. I mean, um, I mean, that's chassis rails. But like, I admit that they are scrap metal at that point and take the parts that are useful off of them instead of trying to sell them for what this but, guy wants but nine you, grand. But you for see, this you, thing? You, under, you have to understand, country. That's the difference between a car that's worth fixing and a car that's not worth fixing. Yeah. Is this car worth fixing? Yeah. It is, because it's an S13. Yeah, it's worth it. It's just, um, 9500 bucks is a stretch for something this. Yeah. 9500 is ridiculous. All right, you want to say Jick or J-I-C today? <laughs> Jick. I always say Jick. Jick magic. <laughs> Jick. All right, we're going J-I-C I don't know magic, if that's right, right but that's, I, it's, it's one of those things that I've never said out loud to anybody. Yeah, I know. You know? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hams. Oh my, oh my god. god. Dude, there's nothing left. Well, it's nice they cut the worst of it out. It looks like my, my grandma grandma's would love couch. That. Oh, there's the sawzall that he used to fix the rust. Nice. That he used to steal the catalytic converter that he used to buy the <laughs> Joanne Fabrics <laughs> headliner. <laughs> no shift boot. There's a 12 mil wrench there on the ashtray. It's missing the, either the plug or, well, it's got to be the plug because it has power. It has manual crank windows, so those aren't power mirrors. You sure that's a uh, 12 mil? How much you willing to bet? The 10 mil ran away, so it's got to be that's 12. That's got to be a 10 mil, dude. Why would there be a 12 mil just laying it, on the It inside? looks too big. Mm. It yeah, looks but too that's big. That's what he said. You would use a 10 mil on more places than you would use a 12. He's got a headliner looking like grandma's ass, dude, on Sunday. This is just... Dude, my luggage looks just like that. <laughs> My grandma got it for me. She's dead. 
Rip. Oh, and it has no yeah. engine. What the? F- it's a piece. It had of no shit. engine. Ninety five hundred dollars with no engine. He Jesus got no Christ. engines. He wants to put the money into that Silverado next to it because he wants something fast. <laughs> what happens with these people, man? <laughs> what happens is they is they ingest all this hype and they start believing the hype and they think that this car that they have, which in all reality is a piece of shit that doesn't even have a quarter window, it yep. is worth $9,000, and that's not the case, I'm He's got sorry. a nice shop going on there, too. Look at the garage on this house. A, Somebody base built this house. A, yeah, a lot of this guy's nice dad. Yeah, it's not the dude that lives in it now. <laughs> this guy's a got a 12-foot fucking door, yeah. Yeah, dude, that's a base-ass fucking garage on this house. That's his friend's house. This is his dad's house. Everybody, everybody listening, you need to take this into consideration. You Just because it's there, you don't have to buy it. It's not worth it. If you want a nice S13 or any car that you desire or you want, you're going to have to put the f***ing footwork in and, and, and find it on your own. And be patient and use collectorcarfee.com. Dot Being slash patient cars. Is, the, is, the, is the best... Slash cars. Yeah, yeah that, that is the best f***ing attribute you can have as a person is being patient because it'll fall on your lap and it'll happen because look we talk about this in 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 the discord a lot like people talk like i have two you know pretty pretty clean s13s that i'm sure a lot of people you know would love to have they oh they're they're super clean super clean not a block away i met i met an old man with a very 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 nice s13 also (laughs) you know so like how how the in this like two city block radius or three of the cleanest S13s in the world. It's not, it's, it, it can't be that uncommon. It, dude, neck ear, this happens. Like the, the town my parents live in, which is like five miles from here, dude has three Dakota convertibles and just talking to the, like, he's the first guy that I met that had a Dakota convertible and he had the four by four one and he won't f-ing sell that one. He's like, I'll sell you one of the two wheel drive ones, but he wouldn't sell that one. And it's like, yeah, like you run into the people that have the same thing, yeah. but they all they also know like you have to be patient. You can't just buy the fucking first one you see because yeah. it's probably fucking garbage. Zach is whack is is exactly correct. He's like, or hear me out. You dump 15k into a shit box and sell for eight. Yeah, that's your other option. He's yep. exactly right. That is your other option. Real quick, don't sh- where you don't sleep is a pretty good sticker idea to rip off a Tommy <laughs> FEF phrase. But also, to add on to what Nick is saying about, like, you know, you don't have to buy the shittiest car that comes along just because it's the first one. Look at this guy's to-do list. This is an eternity of things. Some of it's not, like bleed brakes, whatever. Put in an O2 sensor, whatever. All that, who cares? Oh, the last tune. one, tune. It needs a tune, yeah. You gotta do a bolt check. That's a, like, that, it may as well say soon. Yeah. <laughs> like um like frame rails Soon, is on this list. Just just a regular item, just like bleed breaks. He's got frame rails. Oh, frame rails, yeah. No big deal. Just do the frame rails, dude. This is gonna take your whole life to make this car not suck ass. And you're gonna spend a fortune. And how much did you pay for this car? Yeah. And all that to have an RB20 swapped S13? Right. No. Chase your dream, but chase it right. Don't cut a hole in your hood like a cringe lord. Yeah, rage your dream. Don't chase your dream. Rage right. your yeah. Right. <laughs> rage your dream. Don't fucking chase it, man. Do you live in a society but belong in a society? Do you play bass guitar but wish you were blasting trumpets? Fear not, rude boy, for a benevolent god has created Collector Car Feed, bestowed onto you. At CollectorCarFeed.com, you can use our search tool to easily browse thousands of active vehicle listings for neo classic car cars and trucks. Find exactly the car you want and set your wallet on fire with the help of CollectorCarFeed.com. Thanks to Collector Car Feed, I got my very own 370Z without the hassle of using those other used car sites and apps. A blasting trumpet's throwing that sideways and deaf as the ladies love it too, and I tell you about that, but this voiceover actor wouldn't say the line. This voiceover actor thinks your line was cheap and too on the nose. <coughs> Just like me and your mom on Friday night. Collectorcarfeed.com. Find the fucking car you fucking wanted instead of a bunch of fucking bullshit at collectorcarfeed.com. You have like a fucking soldering iron holder in here? What is this? It's like those, those, uh, what do they call them? Rods, you know? Those like weird animals that they say like exist and they fly, they fly faster than what you can see. What? You trying, trying to freak me out, up, dude? No, dude, look up rods. Go to Google and put... Just rods? <laughs> rods, yeah, rods. yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's that's safe. Yeah, I'm sure this is legit. Oh, it's about to get weird. Is this the point of the night where it gets weird? Yeah, dude. It's... <laughs> that was half an hour ago. Air rods have never been seen live with the naked eye, but are picked up by cameras and cell phones all over the world. I got it. <laughs> but... I got it. It's a rod, dude. He caught it. 
This thing's gonna throw a rod. <laughs> This is a vert. We're skipping it. 89240DX has a 1991 KA24D. Recently installed alternator, battery, brakes, intake, spark plugs, and other little maintenances. Has a kill switch because there's a shorting problem. Has a little rough <laughs> idle but drives great. <laughs> Looking for trades and offers. This kill is, switch this because is the, dead. Say because you, for security purposes. I mean, you could whitewash that. <laughs> yeah, that's no, why I got a quick no he, put, he put the kill switch because there's a bad person to drain he can't figure out. Yeah. At least he's yeah, honest. Yeah, God, I mean, I guess that's nice. Heinous. Yep. Ten gate, ten grand is like way, ten, way, 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 way too much. <laughs> Did you say ten gay? I'll take dude. ten gay right no, now. I, said, bud. I was gonna say ten grand and then ten k. But you came out with ten gay. Ten. Yeah, <laughs> Did I fine. say that? Jesus. Woo! Here is a seven thousand dollar ninety three two forty SX with one hundred seventy nine thousand miles. KBB values at somewhere between seven hundred thirteen dollars and twenty eight fifty three. <laughs> Uh, time to give up. $713. Time to give up on a project I no longer have the time for. I quit. (laughs) Who cares what this even says? Jesus. Oh, Jesus. It's just a bunch. This is It's a manual swap. He's got a 326 power wing, dude. Let's go. We'll come with us. The important shit. He got the important shit done. Yeah. What the fuck? Look at that shift knob, though. Why'd he paint the floor brown? That's a floorboard he's got to put in, right? It's rusto, dude. It looked new. So it was rusty, and he sanded it down and did that? Yeah. I mean, it looks like there's a rust hole in the middle and the bottom there. It's really weird that it's like oh, rust it right brown there, and just, satin. Just painted the floors, was going to weld, panel, glue the flood, the flood hole pieces. Oh, okay. It was going to weld and panel glue the floor. Jesus oh, like, oh, Christ. The little, those are yeah. things, yeah. There's one right there. You know, the All good right. thing about Dakota, odor, Dakota owners is they don't do enough meth to actually work on their cars. They, uh... <laughs> <laughs> they take opiates and let them rust. Yeah, yeah that's yes. it. <laughs> well, how much was and this And he wants seven grand. Yeah. Jesus. No. You guys are fucked. Anyone that wants one of these is in trouble. Yes. It is a real <laughs> problem. <laughs> dude, the heart the heart wants what it fucking wants, dude. And it wants two forties. It wants S thirteens. See, I understand you were born this way, and I'm sorry for you for yeah. being like that. He didn't choose to be this way, dude. Yeah, it's... I know. It's not a choice. I understand. They're based. They are based. They're I see why you like them. <laughs> I just wouldn't want to have to find one at this point. That's all we need to see on that one. Uh, yep. 8,000 bucks, 176,000. Car was perfect. Runs, doesn't drive. <laughs> Bust down. Okay. I'm glad all he right. got his level out to put that sticker on. I think we're kind of done here. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I mean, yeah. Atlas is falling asleep. Dude, I'm done. This looks nice, but we're not going to get to it because Atlas has to go to bed. No, no, no. Has to look, I don't have to pee yet. <laughs> <laughs> you can't sleep till neck ear pees. <laughs> oh, that won't yeah. be long. <laughs> <laughs> look, so the paint is shiny on this one. It's got, what do you think, those are real CR Kai's or reps? Or no, those are the, uh, what the fuck are those wheels? No, you're right. They do look like CR Kai's. Um, let's see if he says. They are no, but Vors they're fake. TR4s. Vors no, TR4. They're, they they're, they're, they're Damien reps. wheels. He's got wide body fenders because Ugh. he already smashed the real ones underneath. It's been repainted. It's Listen got... up, kids. Yeah, tell Listen them. up, kids. Let them know. Wide body will never, ever, ever make your piece of shit worth any more money. Never, ever, ever. If you buy a piece of shit and you think you're going to, like, make it good, guess what? You're not, you know? <laughs> the only way you're going to make a good car good or gooder is if it starts out good and you make it gooder by not doing stupid shit. Or you've already done it 20 times. Yeah. This is not it. This is not how it works. Jeez. No one is going to pay you money for the money you put into a car, especially no. if you use shit parts like this. Oh, damn. He's got, performance. he's got the old logo yeah, ISR. Get out of dude. here, dude. <laughs> no one, nobody that is spending actual money wants blast pipes. No. It's not that bad, but the rest of it is, I mean, honestly, it looks like not, a pretty well put together not car, for but. 12,000. We. No. I've personally, on this hateful channel that we have, I've personally seen better 240s for $12,000. He personally bought a whole ass S13. For, for how like much did you pay for that? A third of this. What did you pay a for? A third it? of this. You paid four for it? Yes. That was a steal. How many miles are on that thing? 124,000. I think I bought it with like 115. You Absolute put 9,000 miles on that thing already? Yeah. You daily it. 
almost. No, they did like in two years. Oh god, was that he two did years for a ago? little bit? Yeah, it's been it's been a minute. You still haven't sold the Baja, dude? What the fuck's wrong? Yeah, with dude, you? I mean, you. he's not getting his money out of the Baja, he's so it's, he's keeping Baja. it. I maybe may know. That's okay. Maybe it's five thousand miles up, but I think it was like one nineteen when I bought it. And it's at 124 now. He's not selling it. I like he's going away from the Baja talk. Yeah, yes. Yeah, That's all right. Away. He's keeping the Baja. That's I'm all right. He built the Baja, Baja for him. It okay. doesn't matter. Yeah, we know. We know. We knew. We knew. We've we known. <laughs> it's cool, dude. It's like. It is it cool. It has Android Auto. Dude. <laughs> 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 all right. So this looks fucked. It's got oh, a clean yeah. title. It's Ew. mint. It's fucked. Fucking mint, dude. Jesus. Fucking mint. Oh, oh, fucking mint. My, oh my god. god. Damn, dude. Gee, it wasn't even ever red. He left his strut tower <laughs> bar on when he painted it, too. No. <laughs> and didn't you're put right, it back on right. afterwards. I was like, I was thinking, like, why is that pattern there? This is like a car country would make. <laughs> oh, fuck you, bud. <laughs> country like that? All right, we have two left, and this is one of them. It's a 96 240 yeah. SX SC, 11.5, 200K, stock KA, runs great. I've driven it from Victorville to Covina plenty of times with no overheating. Has brand new clutch, 100 miles on it, has power steering, full Koki front swap, only thing missing is skirts and taillights, G-Tech short shifter, coilovers all around, current registration in my name, clean title, I have a full subframe and diff solid bushing kit from PBM, welded diff, I can get a full AC system for it if wanted. Has a complete interior, rear toe, and camber arms. It goes on forever. Jeez. And uh, yeah, if you say no doors. overheating in the first sentence, okay, it's been so overheating. Look, yeah. Real quick. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's a big red flag. But imagine, imagine you bought this car. I woke up in a noble guy. <laughs> it does. I swear to God, it doesn't overheat. <laughs> okay, dude. Kind of yeah. weird. Oh my god. This guy would love my Sienna. S15 rear seats, I think? And matching S15 front seats? No, those, those are- those, they, they, they look normal S14. That's an S14 seat. That's an S15 in the passenger S15 in the back. S15 in the passenger for sure. Not in the back, I don't think the back is. S15 passenger seat dash only has one small crack. Last pic shows OEM shift boot. Yeah, I don't know. That's what the S14 seat looked like? And then- With these yeah, stripes? And, and, yeah, and then again, you know what happened is this motherfucker saw S15 driver's seat and bought it. Yeah. That's like, because why the <laughs> f why in, in all of f would you put, oh yeah, this is good. I'm going to put an S15 passenger seat <laughs> in my car. My passenger is going to have so much bolstering, dude. I'm not, not even going to, yeah. I'm not even going to point out what the f is going on with the person in the door, because I'm better than that. Yeah, I, oh yeah, I'm better than that, so I'm not even going to say anything. <laughs> that is a weird move to just do the S15 it's, passenger seat. It, and I guarantee that's what happened. They were like, they they bought that's a all driver's they, that's all seat. They could get. Yeah, they bought a driver's seat, and then they were like, son of a f <laughs> What's in the background there? Is that another <laughs> Nissan? That's, a, that's, that's, a, that's an F, that's a S22A that's, that, that's RX7. A RX7. Yeah, yeah, yeah. First gen RX7. I'm not sure what this is back here, though. That looks like a... That might be an I, international? A, uh, either a early Toyota truck? Oh, it might be an FJ. No, what is that? Let's see. He's got a 5. There's a 510. Here, That's a Datsun 510 right there, the green one. Yo, this guy's got a lot of shit going on. Yeah, yeah he does. This is like the, the worst car. The background of pictures is something. Yeah, this is the worst car he's got. Is that a Sunny? With that There's an RX3. You gotta an sell RX3. your worst car. Uh, so, is that a rotary-powered pickup truck? No, the, no, no, no. Oh, it's RX3. Uh, okay, I RX3, yeah, 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 yeah. Like the rotary god. car. Yeah. There's an FC on the right. Got 11.5 for this fucking pile. It's the worst car he has. He's right. Yeah, yeah really. right. Straight yeah. up. Yeah, straight up. Yeah. I mean, I'm selling my worst truck right now. Hey, did anyone want to buy a $2,000 Dakota 5.9? <laughs> <laughs> it's nice, dude. This is the last car because we got to go to bed. It's, it's a got a Rudolph, Rudolph nose. <laughs> yeah, this is taken around Christmas, uh, but it's listed four hours ago in Valencia, California. It's a 95 240SX SE Coupe, 8500 bucks, 115,000 miles. No, Project time out. Yeah, yeah. 95 S14 Koki. Shut yep. the fuck up. Yep. <laughs> Bullshit. Project yeah, yeah. car that I've been working on restoring. I'm moving up north this summer and I can't bring it with me. Is, does, is moving up north like 
is he dying? And he can't <laughs> take it That's like going to a farm. You know, like you take yeah. your animal it's to a farm. going up to the farm up, uh, up north. Yeah. Yeah. The car is a K24DE with a five-speed manual. The engine has 115K on it. The chassis has 254,000 wow. miles. Tags are good until That's May of next year. Some modifications have been done. Visible in picks. Trades welcome. Prefer cash. Thanks for reading. Shoot me any questions. Ugh. Cringe. Why? Wow. He got he got the uh, <laughs> like the the emo girl belt version of the energy yeah, quick release with the studs. Yeah, the, the hot top. Where's energy. the front of the the seat? It's like bare metal oh, there. Oh yeah, it's missing completely. <laughs> Yo, what the hell? I don't know. It's a bride low, extra low max. Yeah, bud. Oh, um, oh, dude. Oh, the no. I had to pee. I had to pee, but I want to show you one more. <laughs> we know. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we know. <laughs> sound wavy posted one let's take a look at the 10 grand 89 240sx 13 weeks ago pleasanton california oh, that car's gone that's got to be gone uh third owner car is completely original unmolested is a gym for its age and nicer than any other 240sx currently on the market in the bay i have the carfax in hand for the buyer it drives amazing has zero issues it even has working ac and a heater has brand new tires brand new battery ac has been converted to take r134 this is the perfect platform for anyone who wants to get into the s chassis world but doesn't want something that has been ran through and abused the only issues and cons with the car are the crack dash, odometer doesn't work, and the trunk has some rust from the OEM spoiler shown in the pictures. That's incredibly common. Just past smog. Smog is good for 90 days. California sh 14K OBO. Please don't waste my time. The only trades I would consider is something boosted or a C5, oh, C6 Jesus, Corvette. That guy's out of his mind. He's down to 10 grand on this, and this looks really, really nice. I mean, for 10 grand in California, this is... Probably the best one he's seen. No, the mileage is unknown. It's got one, two, three, four, five, six, and he says the odometer doesn't work, so that sucks. The trunk has some rust on it. He says it's from the OEM spoiler, but I guess he filled all the holes already and repainted the trunk and it yeah. rusted through again. Yeah, maybe. It looks like it's been resprayed, actually. Like it's a bright red ten, and ten ten grand is is oh wow. Fifty seven thousand miles. No, it's it's unknown mileage. The odometer doesn't work. Oh. And it's an that's automatic. Like, that's a that's a and good place for automatic. it to break. The automatic's not that big of a deal. It's a pretty cheap swap, really. But yeah, but at the end of the day, like, not this is this is too much money. I don't know. It, uh, it's yeah, it, it kind of is not. What'd you pay for your auto neck here? And is it nicer than this one? Four. And is it nicer than this one? Uh, it, I'd say it's about the same. So, do you have any real paint issues on yours at all? You had like a dent that you fixed. No a dent. That's all. No real paint issues. Yeah, I mean, this has some like, like rust. Like going no on. rust. Yeah, no rust issues. I don't know. I think it needs to come down a little bit more, but I mean, this is an exceptionally yeah, nice if you can't, If you can't prove the miles, you're going to have to come down. If All right, it's let still me find available. This. Yeah, let 10K is a lot for unknown mileage. It is a 1997 Toyota Celica GT, oh, GT4. Oh, let's hear this beast. Oh, he did the stupid thing. Oh, look at this. <laughs> yeah, the cringe <laughs> Jesus. thing. Jesus. I'm in. The other person's I'm worse. I'm going backwards in a drive through I went through the drive through backwards because I'm so fucking cool. Yeah, so I want you to read the description. Right-hand drive Celica GT. This Celica was imported in 2022 and titled in New Mexico shortly after. This Japanese model features a 2-liter 4-cylinder 3S GT GE. Hold on. Uh, the 4-cylinder 3S <laughs> GE sick. mated to a 5-speed manual transmission. It is rated for 200 horsepower from the factory. Tasteful mods leave the engine and drivetrain almost completely untouched. Runs and drives super well. AC runs cold. 169,001 kilometers, 98,000 miles. DM me an offer. Thanks. Please look at photos for a list of mods. He imported a 3SGE. What an idiot. And then made it look like a GT4. Yeah. Through the drive through backwards, bud, you know? I thought it was a GT4 at first. I did too. I, I thought for sure it was a GT4, but surprise it's a he put clone. in the work bud <laughs> oh jesus <laughs> it, it's a fucking clone it's a front wheel drive 3s ge with and i don't think it's rated at 200 horsepower like the 5s fe that we got was for like um like 130 horsepower 130 I think. yeah the 3s ge i i really don't believe that a 6g celica was making 200 on a 3s ge i think that the fucking gt4 was rated for like 205 yeah there's no way look at that emergency brake look at the parking brake drift button what the fuck to what end you need a drift mm. button for is this an fes spec it's horn? like it's like someone giving you the middle finger yeah it's a grip royal it looks like Tommy F. Yeah's first shirt, which is just like it said, it Jeez. said Tommy F. Yeah, and it had a guy flipping the middle finger on it. The passenger seat's okay. The, the inner, oh, the, uh, the stock oh, seat. All the, the, nor the stock seats are okay. 
I like the pattern. Uh, yeah, the, yeah pattern like the pattern of the seats is fine. This is the ultimate cope. I bought a car and I wanted the look. I want to be driving on the other side and I want it to look like a GT4, but I can't back anything up at all whatsoever. And I'm a poser cringe lord. Yes. It is that. It is exactly that. And on that note, thank you for watching. Discord.gg slash feed. You want to talk some sh? You want to talk some sh? <laughs> talk some sh? Yeah, so, you know, come over there. Um, yeah. I woke up in a new Jesus Christ. <laughs>